Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. My name is Valerie Boswell and I'm going to talk to you a little bit uh, about self-motivation today. Now this can be for a paparazzi consultant, this can be for uh, a somebody who is considering being a paparazzi consultant or this can be just for any person who wants to be self-motivated. So welcome if you found me you're probably looking up paparazzi, you're probably looking up self-motivation or you're probably just kind of deciding still on whether or not you want to become a paparazzi consultant. More about that at the end of this video. But first of all um, self-motivation. Uh, you've got to uh, get your work ethic together first of all. Um, your self-motivation in when you own your own business, which is what I'm going to base this around, when you own your own business uh, is very, very important. You've got to get rid of things that are time wasters. If you are just sitting there on TikTok, if you're playing those little games on your phone, uh, if you're just sitting there on Insta or Snapchat, uh, get off of those things if they are time wasters, and I'll let you be the judge of that. Um, success has no elevator. You have got to take the stairs, so you've got to make yourself uh, uncomfortable. Uh, not comfortable, uncomfortable. Um, um, in other words, you got to be comfortable being uncomfortable, uh, is what I'm saying. So, uh, you've got to not... I mean, downtime is fine. Okay, first let me say that. Downtime is fine if you schedule it into your day. Okay, after you've gotten everything that you've uh, on your to-do list for the day, then you can go ahead and do what you need to do on TikTok and just veg out. That's cool. That's no problem. But before that, make sure that you're not uh, setting yourself up for failure. We all set ourselves up for either failure or success. And uh, I've decided myself this month I am going to go live every single day this month because uh, I've decided that I am going to be successful. Uh, I have decided that I am going to uh, be happy about it and I am grateful for the customers I have, I just want to get more customers. So that's why I'm going live every single day. My husband doesn't understand it, but guess what? He doesn't have to understand it. I understand it. So I'm getting busy. I suggest you do the same thing. Get your work ethic together and uh, get yourself self-motivated. Uh, first of all, I want you to protect yourself from negativity. And the way you do that is you get grateful you salve yourself up with gratitude, okay? And that just makes negativity bounce off of you. Um, when you're grateful, you don't have time to even hear any negative because right now you're living what you probably prayed for somewhere in your past. So there's a lot to be grateful for. Even the little things we take for granted. I, I'm sighted, I can see, uh, I can walk, um, you know. I can talk. Some people, you know, don't have those blessings. So we really need to uh, be filled with gratitude every day. So I suggest maybe get in a journal and writing down the things you're grateful for. Um, that will help you um, block out anything that's negative. Um, so a plan is what you want to do. You want to make a plan. Um, you want to make a daily plan, a weekly plan, a monthly plan. Now, I'm going to use myself as an example. Uh, this month, I am going live on my business page with my jewelry for sale every single day this month. Now, how do I do that? Well, daily, I have to set up a time where I'm going to plan a show, uh, whether it be a color that I'm showing for that day, whether it be I'm doing sets, whatever it may be. Um, but then I have to come in here and I have to put together a certain amount of jewelry so that I can fill up at least 30 to 40 to maybe even an hour's worth of uh, a show. Um, then a weekly, um, I, I've set myself up with a said number of items that I want to sell within the week. Uh, if it means I go live two times a day, so be it. That's what's going to happen. So uh, 
I have weekly goals. And then monthly, obviously, I'm going live every single day this month. So I have my regular lives, which is, I go live three times a week uh, normally. So uh, monthly, I would have to, uh, like my husband has um, different uh, doctor's appointments throughout the month. So I would have to plan around his doctor's appointments, obviously, uh, because we have one car and he likes me to go with him and I like to go with him. So that's what I would do. I even have long-term goals. Uh, you can do uh, yearly goals. Uh, I know uh, for paparazzi consultants, uh, life of the party is a goal uh, for us. And you can actually break that goal down into quarterly goals uh, or every three months. Uh, you can say, I'm going to sell this many pieces of jewelry in three months and so on and so forth and you can there's a little checklist that you can uh, do and if you're on my team I certainly will send that to you uh, just let me know in the comments down here uh, but short term again just don't go to bed before your daily goal is met so that's one way to stay self-motivated if you need to write these things down go ahead and do so I I have mine committed to memory, so I know what I need to do before I go to bed. Um, and for me, I will share that uh, I set my uh, weekly goal is to, every Sunday night, I set up my good morning message or my wear it Wednesday message or my tip Tuesday message. I schedule those uh, messages uh, on Sunday all at once so I don't have to think about it um, in my team group I try to do that same thing uh, sometimes I have one of my uh, my girls uh, in there that is a, uh, a seasoned consultant she helps me to post motivational things also um, so uh, daily again just don't go to bed without um, finishing what you set out to do that day um get a routine um get a routine so uh, a weekly routine or a daily routine uh, for me when i'm working i make my coffee in the morning I, I grab like a a breakfast bar and a banana that's usually my breakfast before because if i don't eat in the morning i'm really not alert and i'm no good and so since i am a school bus driver i try to i pray for alertness also but it, if i have something in my system it makes me more mentally alert um so i get up i make my bed that's always good because i've already accomplished something for the day um and for you it might be um since you're going to be self-motivated, you're going to set a goal of, I'm going to wake up at uh, a certain time in the morning, and then I'm going to walk the dog, and then I'm going to, you know, whatever it is. Um, but be honest with yourself when you're setting your goals. You don't want to set a goal that you're not going to meet, that you know you can't meet. Uh, don't say, well, I'm going to wake up at 5 a.m., and then I'm going to walk the dog. And, and you know, first of all, do you normally wake up anytime near five o'clock? I mean, if you've been sleeping in till maybe eight or nine, you probably don't want to set such a lofty goal because you're probably going to just set yourself up to be disappointed in yourself. So get something that is going to be uh, a doable goal so you can feel good about it. Now, you know, um, five o'clock, I can probably do. Maybe five o'clock, you cannot do. So, um, it usually takes about six months to make a habit, so uh, maybe you can uh, back yourself up like every week until you get to five o'clock, if, if that's even your goal. Um, it does add more time in your day, so sometimes that is helpful as being self-motivated and setting your goals. Um, <clears throat> but kind of bring in and join your old habits in with your new habits. Um, so maybe if you already walk your dog in the morning, whenever you do that, also add in your uh, daily self affirmations uh, when you're walking the dog. You know, maybe that's something you want to add into your uh, being self motivated and being gratitude, being grateful. I mean, uh, you can um, 
list off the things you're grateful for as you're walking the dog. That will help you start your day on a positive note. Um, but this is the other thing, which kind of sounds like an oxymoron, but you want to take a break every now and again from your business. Of course, you want to have uh, uh, work your business, but you want to uh, make sure that you're uh, freshening your, your brain up or your ideas up by talking to other people. Um, it will inspire you. Uh, and then, because um, I'm not saying just all, all work and no play makes Jill a dull girl, right? So you definitely want to make time for your friends. But you don't want to like go away for the whole weekend. You can if you've already met your goals for that week. But make sure that you're, uh, you're, you're hitting your sales goals. You're, you're hitting your uh, personal goals. Um, and, you know, along with that... Set rewards for yourself. Definitely set rewards. If you're going away uh, on a trip or whatever, or if you're just getting your nails done or your hair done because you hit your sales goal, do that. I mean, that is something that you should reward yourself, girl. If you if you have hit your uh, goals, uh, definitely if you want to buy that new gadget or uh, whatever it is, that new lipstick, do that. And be sure you're staying positive uh, and Understand what makes you happy. Understand what makes you happy. Uh, being self-motivated uh, is important, but make sure you're doing what makes you happy as well. You, you have to, again, join uh, Mary in what you already do with your business goals. And uh, if you need help with that, I'm here uh, to help you. Um, quality time with your friends is an excellent thing. Um, purchasing your favorite gadget as i've said uh that those things are rewards and you're definitely uh, allowed to reward yourself um <clears throat> at the end of the month after i've gone live every single day of the month uh my reward is simply to hopefully have seen my business grow to see um uh, more customers and to uh, see uh my sales uh, skyrocket hopefully and I'm, I'm doing this to gear up for the uh, holidays so there are reasons why I do that and I work for myself because I can be self-motivated I can have financial freedom I can uh, work without having a boss breathing down my neck and I that's another thing I love about my day job my bus job I am the boss of my bus it's great uh, I'm helping others. That's another thing I love to do. That's why I work for myself. Um, I do what I love. I love doing what I do. And I get to spend more time at home I'm, as opposed to going out and getting a part-time job, say, at McDonald's, wiping down tables. I get to stay here and play with jewelry. So it's awesome. Um, <clears throat> so set yourself some reminders, whether it be writing it down. Alexa can help you with stuff like that. Um, organize. Organizing your your show it might take you 30 minutes it might take you 20 minutes uh it might take you a whole day i don't know um plan out even um like i have to plan what i'm gonna purchase uh depending on what i'm buying so that also takes a little bit of juggling too um networking maybe you're gonna network on facebook maybe you're gonna network out in town when you're doing your grocery shopping i don't know how you network uh, but if you're already on Facebook, go ahead and network that way. Uh, say happy birthday to everybody who has a birthday that day. Uh, comment on their cute dog or their grandbaby. Oh, precious, so oh, beautiful, blah, blah, blah. That keeps uh, you connected with your customers, and that lets you see their posts. But more importantly, it lets them see your posts. Um and as you do that, as you set your reminders, as you write down what you need to do, it's going to help you become more efficient uh, in what you're doing, and it's going to have you estimate your time better in your day. Um, <clears throat> what I like to do is I like to watch inspirational trainings. Um, I like to have a cup of coffee every day, so I will watch a training 
and have a cup of coffee every day, every single day. Now, it could be uh, Billy Graham training. It could be Joel Olstein training. It could be Charles Stanley training. It could be a paparazzi training of an up, upper echelon of, of paparazzi because the best uh, way to be successful is to watch people who have already been through where you've been in paparazzi. Now, we all start as star consultants, so if you go back and you watch the Jet Setter do her live or, or uh, do her speed sale, it'll help you uh, know what to do. And, and there's nothing wrong with emulating uh, somebody who's very successful. That's, that's important. Um, and then take action. Um, focus on what will happen. Focus on if you keep going. What's going to happen if you keep going? Uh, again, this is why I work for myself. Uh, I plan each day with goals I'm going to achieve. And I'm the one in charge of that, you know. So, if you might want to do a pro and con list. If I do A, how is that going to affect B? Or if I do A, what's going to happen... If I didn't choose B, you know, just things like that help me organize my thought process um, and do little bites. Focus, dedication, not everyone has these things, but you can learn how to uh, train yourself to have them. It takes time. It takes practice not to do, uh, to do so. Um, so don't let lack of planning. Don't let no schedule, don't let distractions of your family or anything else uh, ruin your chance at being a success because you are totally in control of that. So what are you waiting for? Go get it, girl. <laughs> Go get your stuff done. Go do it. Um, we can succeed together. Um, so that is my talk on self-motivation. Hopefully uh, it helps you. If you have questions, comments, concerned, as always, put them right down here in the comments. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Again, I'm Valerie Boswell, and uh, I am here for you. If you want to join Paparazzi, now is actually the time. This is October 2022, and uh, there is a, a special going on this month uh, of extra pieces in our starter kits. Uh, if you didn't know, our starter kits normally come, well, the $99 kit comes with 35 pieces, the $299 kit comes with 120 pieces, and the $499 kit comes with uh, 200 pieces. Well, this month only, in October of 2022, uh, in the preview pack, the smallest pack, the $99 pack, which is what I started with. There's no shame in that uh, small amount. It's it's totally uh, getting your foot in the door. I ain't mad at you. That's where I started. Um, so instead of 35 pieces, you get 45 pieces. So that's more money in your pocket. Um, a small party pack usually comes with 120 pieces, as I said. This month only, 150 pieces. And it ships free. And then the large home party pack usually comes with 200 pieces. You're getting 250 pieces. Again, money in your pocket, and it ships free, and you get a free convention ticket in the $4.99 kit. Now, uh, the convention ticket is anywhere from $180 to $200, depending on your taxes in your uh, state. Uh, we usually have our convention the first week of August every year. And uh, that's our fiscal year end is July 31st. So that's why we have that big party in August. So, um, and I believe if you don't use it the first year, you can use it the following year. You just have to call paparazzi and let them know, hey, psh, this is what's happening. I want to use it next year. And they'll let you, which is really, really cool of them. So anyway, uh, come discover what is possible when you join a winning team. Uh, this is my small opportunity. If you want to be motivated, if you want me to help you, uh, I also have higher ups behind me that can help you too. Uh, I would love to be your sponsor and I would love to help you out. So anyway, hopefully this talk helped you today and uh, I hope to see you back here for more trainings with Valerie and Valerie's Vault.
Have a blessed evening and day. Bye.